Paul Michael. Michael Simons, one of the GM engineers, and we are just driving the new Chevrolet Colorado with the diesel engine, huh? like a new addition to the very successful truck already. Correct. So can you tell us a little bit about the, the new engine for this truck? Yeah, so uh, this is our 2.8 liter Duramax uh, diesel that's in the Colorado. Um, it's, uh, it's 369 uh, foot-pounds of torque, 181 horsepower. Oh, a lot. You can do a lot with that. Absolutely, yeah. It's really, uh, as we do the off-road course here, you'll see the uh, really, uh, the torque really is there whenever you need it for the hill climbs and the hill descents. What's the towing capacity for this for this truck? The towing capacity is uh, 7,700 pounds with a two-wheel drive, and uh, for a four-wheel drive, it's 7,600 pounds. And uh, what kind of mileage do you get? I bet you can go a long way with a <laughs> gas of this Yeah, yeah for sure. Uh, we, we haven't announced the fuel economy numbers, uh, but uh, for sure it'll be uh, best in segments of uh, fuel economy. When the and how big is, is the tank? Uh, it's a 21 gallon tank. 21, wow, that's uh, big. So you can probably go hundreds of miles with it, like five, six hundred miles maybe. With yeah, it. it's not unrare to, to fill the tank up and see over 600 miles as your range. So it's uh, yeah. it's nice you don't have to fill up quite as often. And uh, on top of the new diesel engine, this particular model is equipped with uh, some accessories for 2016, right? Like yeah. it's also new for a Colorado. What, what we're driving is our Trail Boss Edition, and uh, this is a package that um, includes the Duramax diesel, but it also has uh, our Goodyear Duramax or Duratrack tires, which is a aggressive off-road tire. Uh, we also have a, uh, uh, a light bar with off-road lights in the bed, spray-in bed liner. It's got some wheel flares. Um, it's got the blackout tire uh, wheels and, and also. Uh, the blackout bow ties that's kind of an appearance package yeah so very capable and very uh, uh good looking too exactly yeah so one of the features that this one has is the hill descent right Correct. how does that work the hill descent control uh, basically is an off-road uh off-road feature which allows you to control your speed as you're descending down a hill do you have to do anything to set it up or it just goes uh, on automatically there well there is a button to turn it on okay uh, it's the right hand most uh in the in the uh, buttons right below so the one uh, center stack. Yeah, so that was uh, one touch turns on and you oh, get I a, turn uh, it off and then you're back on. Okay. Right. And, and you'll get an icon in the dash that shows that you're enabled. Okay. And then once you're cresting a hill and, and get about a 10% downgrade, whatever speed you're going, it'll hold you at that speed so you can just focus on driving and not have okay, to worry We're going about like braking. three miles an hour and you're just doing it on its own, like the braking part. I still have to steer, obviously. Right. And then you have you said you can increase it up here yeah you there's two ways to increase it you can just use your accelerator pedal and, oh, and okay. go a little faster or the brake if you want to slow down and it'll hold you whatever speed you end up at and what's the top uh speed for hill descent uh it works up to 18 miles an hour oh 18 that's or, fast or about uh, 30 kph so wow i mean 18 miles an hour going in a hill in a steep hill it's, it's, yeah, yeah it can be fun yeah i think it'd be plenty i don't know if you'd want to go too much faster <laughs> So what are the features that they have like for the off-roading capability of this? Well, the, the, the 2016 Diesel Colorado gets the uh, our automatic transfer case, which gives you the on-demand uh, four-wheel drive, as well as you can switch into four-high or four-low if, if you need that, uh, you know, that kind of traction. Yeah. Um, it comes with a standard rear locking differential. Um, as I mentioned before, it's it's got the Duratrack uh, uh, your dirt track tires which are very good in the off-road and then we've tuned the suspension for the for those tires and for the diesel engine uh, so it works really well in the off-road terrain excellent and on top of all that you can have five passengers some cargo in the back so you can do a lot with this truck. yeah huh? it's a very comfortable truck it's uh, it's big enough that you know you can fit comfortably you don't feel like you're in a compact vehicle and yeah, uh, there's ample room in the in the rear seats. But also, you don't like feel that. like you're in a huge truck either. I mean, like when you drive on the regular streets and all that. I mean, you feel like it's pretty easy to maneuver, and you can park pretty easily almost anywhere. Exactly, and very uh, nimble. It's easy to, you know, good ride and handling with enough power, and it feels very athletic uh, as you're driving it. So.
Excellent. Well, thank you very much for your time and uh, opportunity to drive this in the off-road. I wish there was some water here in California, but I think we'll have to go to the ocean for that. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe that would be a good idea. So, there you go. Thank you.